Thing. All right, um, guys back, so it's fun when guys here. You know what, we've got great healthy snacks for you. I know as soon as you hear healthy, you're like, I don't know, I tuned out. But think about this, all right? I went to the movies this weekend. What's the best thing about every single movie? The popcorn, of course. You can have that amazing movie theater style taste in your own home because Kelsey Nixon has made the perfect microwave popcorn. I know if you think microwave popcorn, you think of all the gunk and the yuck. This is none of the yuck, all of the great flavor. And we've got four gorgeous colors for you. This is the poppy red. We have it in Moroccan blue. Here's the mint, and this is the canary yellow. And you notice what I notice about this. This is made of glass, but every kernel is big and fluffy and perfect and that great crunch that you crave. We're gonna show you how many different ways you can enjoy this tasty and healthy snack. And Stacy Phillips is here to show us exactly how to do that. Welcome to the show. Good morning. Good morning. Hi, everybody. I just have to say it smells incredible so good, right? in here. I know. And you know, Everybody loves popcorn, right? And yeah. what I think is so cool about popcorn is you can just pop it, add a little bit of salt, and it's the perfect healthy snack. It's low carb, it's low fat. In fact, this pops eight cups of popcorn, oh but in three cups of popcorn, you can have less than 100 calories. Again, it's low carb, it's gluten free, it's a perfect Monday through Thursday snack because I've got mm. some weekend snacks. It's elevating your popcorn, but it's so simple. You don't have to add any type of oil. All you do is you come over, you choose any type of kernel that you would like, and all you need is a third of a cup. That is it, okay? So this is all you do. You add the kernels straight to the glass mm. uh, bowl, and that's it. You put the silicone lid on top, and then you place this right in the microwave. That's this, it. Every microwave's a little bit different. It's anywhere from like one to four minutes. Okay. This microwave, we've already done one. This microwave happens to be two minutes and 50 seconds for the perfect pop. So I'm gonna go ahead and set this. It's really simple. So how are we gonna figure out how many minutes our microwave needs? It's after you you hear it, the popping start to slow down, ah. right? So when you, you get about three seconds okay. in between the pop, you know it's ready. Okay. And this is what you get every single time. Mm -hmm. And you know what I love about this is you're not adding oil. You're not adding butter unless you want to. And that's why I call it the Monday through Thursday popcorn where you just add a little bit of salt. But if you want to elevate it, here's what you do. Mm. You take your whatever color you want. Your Moroccan Kelsey, blue, I like you, that uh, one. This blue is really mm -hmm. pretty, isn't it? Very okay, pretty. so then you add your kernels, your third of a cup once again, and then you just put the silicone lid on top, and then you add just a pat of butter. Now, if you like lots of butter, then you put lots of butter, or oh, right you just put the butter right on top. Here's what happens. As it is cooking and your popcorn is popping, what's happening? The butter is melting. So the first oh. layer of, but, of popcorn has butter, then the second layer of popcorn has butter, and then the top layer of oh my popcorn goodness, has butter. So it's drizzled <gasps> so evenly and perfectly throughout. All you have to do is take it out and toss it with a little bit of, of salt, mm. and it is absolutely perfect every single time. This is how easy it is. And here's the fun thing about popcorn. You can have a very healthy snack. Yeah. Again, you have all, it's low fat, it's, it's just, it's the perfect food. But what if you oh want gosh, to so elevate bad. it a notch? Here's bacon. No, -uh. You can take bacon bits. You can take just uh, fresh bacon. Maybe you have some leftover bacon from uh, Sunday morning. And then you take some maple syrup. Uh. Now this is definitely elevating popcorn, right? I mean, look Whoa. at that. That uh, is fantastic. Who would have thought of that? But this is really, really good. It's something fun. It's a little bit more gourmet. gourmet. And then you have your popcorn with your syrup. That looks incredible. And Stacy, because yes. we saved all of the calories by not having to add any of those hydrogenated fats and heavy oils, right. you can save it for what tastes good, the bacon and the syrup. <laughs> We've got it at $10 off for you today, and you can get it home for under $10. If you have been making the microwave popcorn because you think it's a little bit healthier than maybe something else. Look at the ingredients. You have to look at the ingredients and half of me won't even be able to pronounce. When you make your Kelsey Nixon microwave popcorn, it's going to be corn and maybe that's it. It could be corn and salt. It could be corn and butter. It, real live butter, not live butter, but you know, yeah. real, <laughs> real true, delicious, aromatic, flavorful butter. 
It could be Parmesan cheese. It could be, oh, what are you doing now? It could s'mores. be anything, but for $9.98, s'mores. S'mores popcorn. are my favorite. What is that? Is that uh, sweetened condensed this milk is, or something? This is um, marshmallows. No. Yes. Just melted? Melted, melted marshmallow <gasps> sauce. And then there you go. This is the s'mores. I mean, doesn't that look just delightful? So you can be as sinful or as healthy as you want. You I'm not even going to mix that up. Friend. I just think that looks fantastic, don't you? <laughs> I mean, I guess we could. We could play with it. We could really kind of mix it up and sure. get it all nice and chocolatey. Oh my goodness. But these are s'mores. This would be great for a birthday party. What about, you know, people are coming over and you're thinking, I want something different. You could do all sorts of different flavors of popcorn. And look, the, the chocolate starts to melt. You could make popcorn balls. You could do this for mm. Halloween. I mean, po popcorn really is the perfect snack. I absolutely love popcorn. Mm -hmm. I mean, it really is my favorite snack. And then s'mores are my favorite dessert. So you put the two of these together and voila, you have a wonderful, Wonderful, wonderful snack. Well, what's great about this is if you are that, you, you crave salty and crunchy like potato chips or pretzels or anything like that, this is that perfect, the, the, it, it really just like meets that need. You know what it I mean? Does. You've got the salty sweet and, and salty. the crunch. Or yeah, if you want a little sweet, you can go with the sweet, put, add chocolate into it. I, I mean, any of it's these perfect, with the syrup right? and the marshmallows. And if you have seen what you are feeding your children in the microwave popcorn, Oh my gosh, look at that. Right? Wait, from a third, from a third of a third cup. Third of a cup. Popcorn. Look at how full that is. You now, know how much money I, you're saving. I want to show you something. I'm going to show you what your microwave popcorn is in a minute. But did you notice that I grabbed this out of the microwave and I don't have oven mitts? It's cool to the touch. This is a high quality glass made for the microwave. So I can take it right out of the microwave and I'm holding it. This is hot. The handle is nice and cool to the touch. And then I have silicone on top, which automatically starts to cool immediately, okay? So if I had butter, I would just grab it right here by the tip and take it off. And then look, it is so full. Okay, a third of a <laughs> cup of butter. Look at that. It is so full, it barely comes out. Okay, so you got to kind of get a spoon or something, and you just got to move it around a little bit. But just that is right how much popcorn. I mean, mm. that is a lot of popcorn. And did you notice? I don't have a bunch of kernels. I don't have a bunch of kernels. And look at how nice and fluffy. Think about oh doing goodness. this at the office. Oh. You can grab one of these so simply. It's so lightweight, so compact. Mm. Take it to the office and keep it in the kitchen, and then you can have a snack, as opposed... Yeah, we gotta throw some salt on and it if you're gonna eat this. And it's a snack you can share with everybody, right? If you've everybody got one wants bag to... of microwave popcorn, you're keeping it all to yourself. But when you're making eight cups, right. you're able to share it with everybody in the office. You don't feel like you don't, you know, like you have to go back and get more. This is a, a really inexpensive way, and now that I do microwave popcorn yes. like this, I've saved so much money because it's dollars a bag. And you can buy the boxes and think, think what happened. You buy three of those family packs, you could have paid for this and then some, right? You could have bought one for a friend mm. because it does get expensive. Now let's talk about this. I'm gonna cut this You're in half, okay? We've all done the microwave popcorn. And honestly, I think it tastes good. You probably do too. But what are you getting? This is the comparison. Here's what I'm getting with fresh kernels, right? There's nothing added, nothing goopy or gross, no food coloring. This is a natural product. Here's what I'm getting with microwave popcorn. Ew. I honestly don't know what that is. There's food coloring, there's, you Ew. know, fake cheese, <gasps> and, you, and you remember, this isn't refrigerated, or refrigerated. So look at the difference. Which would you rather have? This, which, again, mystery, and have you ever had that taste in your mouth after eating microwave popcorn? It's, yeah, there's, it's it leaves like a, film. a film. Right, so we don't know what that is. So well, which can, one of these now you know why. would that's, you rather have? Well. So if you're popping this and giving this to your family, that's it's a little bit of a mystery. Or you can have fresh kernels. And here's the thing. It doesn't take special popcorn. It takes any type of popcorn that you want. Mm. So you buy the, the, I actually like the white popcorn the best, the white kernels. You just fill a third of a cup. It's that simple. Just drop it in. Again, if you want to do butter, you can do butter. Uh, let's grab a pad of butter with my fingers, right, just like that. And again, what's going to happen is the butter is going to continue mm. to melt. I mean, doesn't this look fantastic? And here it's also butter control. Because if you go to the movie theaters, who doesn't love movie theater popcorn? Right. But there's gobs of butter, gobs of salt. Here you are monitoring the amount of butter. All you did is added your fresh, added your fresh kernels, and the butter is melting each layer of the popcorn absolutely perfectly. And let me tell you, you are going to love how easy this is to clean. It is dishwasher uh. safe, but you don't even need to. I mean, look at, this is the one I used. 
this is not a cleanup nightmare. No. All you do is rinse it out, maybe out. with a little soap and water. But of course, you can put it in the microwave. It, but it's really, really because simple. Because there's no grease in there. There's no there's no muck. Today right. you're saving ten dollars, which basically is like thirty five percent off of the main price. Nine dollars and ninety eight cents. <laughs> we got thirty You've probably seconds. seen Kelsey Nil Kelsey Nixon on so many different shows and cooking shows, and this is the way to get more flavorful food that's actually better for you. I'm always telling my kids to eat corn. Like, right, I'll open a can of corn or something, or they'll eat corn on the cob yes. as their vegetable. Mm -hmm. My daughter now, is at 10, will ask for popcorn every time she comes home, and she thinks it's like we're at the movies. Like, it's the biggest <laughs> treat. I had a great day at school today. Can I have some popcorn? And in my head, I'm like, fiber, yes, sure. vegetable, absolutely. And just a minimum of salt or nothing at all. Because that's right. Because it tastes so great and so fresh. You're certainly not going to miss the muck that you get in the microwave popcorn and yet it's still just as convenient. Look, this just popped, right? Watch Two this look. I'm seconds. grabbing it with my hand. I'm not burning myself. And all of my butter is gone. Remember, this is the one with the butter. This is silicone. If you're not familiar with silicone, so easy to clean. Cool to the touch immediately. Watch the steam. This is hot right out of the oven, but I'm not burning myself. Look at that steam. That is fantastic. And each kernel is perfectly, perfectly popped. Look, wow. no seeds. And it has the just the right amount of butter. Of course, you can add more butter, sure. of course, but right? But each one has just as much butter. That's the problem with the movie theater. Right. Is that you put the, the butter just on the top. butter oil, <laughs> that butter grease stuff that you put on the very top, and there's nothing on the bottom, and then um, <clears throat> the bottom is dry. The other thing is, this is fresh when you make it. Yep. You don't know how long those kernels have been stuck in that bag with that muck. You can barely find the kernels in right? that. I mean, this really is such a big difference. I found um, ruby red popcorn kernels. It was talking oh, about how, how many fun. antioxidants are in there and how incredible it is. Look at that birthday cake popcorn. I know, this is popcorn. birthday cake popcorn. You I'm know, just gonna keep making fun popcorn. So and many did fun. you see and there's this? there's a recipe book that comes with it as well. It's so many different ways to be able to make your savory popcorn, your garlic and rosemary, or your peanut butter popcorn. Uh, so many recipes in there, but you also, with all of Kelsey's um, items, you also get, uh, uh, there's some recipes that aren't necessarily the popcorn popper. But look at this, look how cute. Popcorn, everybody loves popcorn. It's really popular right now, no pun intended. Huh. But look, getting ready to pop, this is is perfect for a little baby shower oh, gift. You could do birthdays. You can see you can decorate. These little things you could buy literally at dollar type stores. What is, it? What is this on top? It's the red. just the frosting that you get from the grocery store. You know, you can just dribble on, drizzle oh, on top or you can idea. do a white chocolate. That's what I did here. I did white chocolate and some sprinkles and you can make savory because this, I don't know if you saw just a second ago, but this is buffalo sauce with a little bit of butter and then Ooh. I use celery salt. This is absolutely delicious if you want to try that. Mm, I'm just eating That's, the birthday cake one. Oh, and then we have s'mores. <laughs> so we have the bacon, maple, and mm, then I, I also one. have, we only have a minute mm. left, but I want to show you what else you can do. You can oh grab gosh. some popcorn and you can put any of your savory favorites. So let's just say you're having people over and instead of doing the classic, you know, cheese and crackers, you can do something like this. So mm. you can add a little bit of your so butter. Good right to the top let's say you didn't add the butter while you were cooking and you and you thought maybe you'd add some herbs this is just the ranch sauce that you can buy in oh, yeah, the grocery powder. store the powder yep so you can sprinkle just a little bit of that on there give it a little color and a little flavor and of course you'll toss it around and here are just some fresh dried chives and there you go you can also do parmesan you can do all sorts of cheeses mm. i mean really have fun with the popcorn but here's what i want you to take away from this today the popcorn is so easy it is so healthy it is gluten free three cups of this this makes eight cups of popcorn but three cups is only a hundred calories it's healthy it's low carb you can also step it up a notch and do all sorts of fun desserts and savory favorites you're gonna love it bacon and syrup i'm in Count right me in stacy <laughs> um just today you're saving ten dollars so just choose your favorite color the one that makes you um that makes you smile and it's a glass container you can use this as a carafe you can use it as a pitcher later we have that um poppy red moroccan blue there's the mint and there's a canary yellow and there's a guy who just came in which, which, which one, one is tempting you, like you by you know what i like about this here's one's popcorn uh, oh, <laughs> a cup of popcorn. That's why I like it. You know, you can't eat this it right from the jar. This is my popcorn. Guy it's in my popcorn <laughs> mug. That's how I would eat it. I'd be like, hey, guys, how's it going? <laughs> One of the things that we hadn't actually thought of. A popcorn mug. That's exactly what it is. Popcorn you could buy mug. like you're having if you're having your buddies over to watch the game, everybody gets their own little mug. Actually, that's a popcorn cool. mug. <laughs> and then when you're done, you pour you something, like you pour a couple, juice, you pour right? a little beer in it. <laughs> 
Cheers. A Stein, a popcorn Stein. Oh. Hey, you know, that's why we got that guy here, because he comes up you with know, things we never would have thought that's right. of before. Yeah. I, I was thinking lemonade, but... Yeah. You no. know, but sure. Beer I, I, every time I like, watch you guys, I'm like, I'm like that. I would, I would suck that whole thing of popcorn out. Show us popcorn. You anyway, can too. Thank you. You know, for that. yeah, Stacy, great job too.